Okay, Somerville. Options. Graphics. Uh, can we? Okay, I guess this needs a controller because everything else doesn't work. Okay. Off. Headphones. Uh. Here we go. <laughs> The Eye of Sauron. Ashnaz <laughs> Klimbadur. Yeah, total. <laughs> it's not a lot of RAM, is it? That's a whole lot of road to Somerville. <laughs> Seven to ten years, that's the rule, huh? Doggo is happy to be home. <laughs> Yay! Oh, I have no idea about consoles. I own a PS1. That's all I have. <laughs> Excuse me. So this game is not very well optimized, is it? No, it's burning through my GPU. <laughs> oh, excitement. They had a long trip, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> How 
are they sleeping through that? Oh, I'm in control of the little dude. <laughs> Look at me walking around. A weird sound coming from outside. Could you wake up? Oh. Isn't that adorable? Wakey, wakey, parents. Come on. I'm kicking off... Kicking off the stuff here. It's a bit scary because there are bad noises. Like thumping noises against the door. You can hear the noises, right? Still charging. It's, it's a fox with a glowing nose. <laughs> so whatever that was, it, it's gone now. I'm too small, I can't open the door. <laughs> I got it. Come here, you. It's copy. I think it's aliens. I forgot the glowing fox. Bit of an issue. Here. Oh, I can't get back. Crap. Oh. Are we gunning for the fridge or? Hmm. Um. I don't know what to do. Well, I clicked start from checkpoint.
If I could find the light switch and reach it. But as soon as you get here, he drops the he drops the thingy. Question is, can I pick it up again? I can't. So I'm supposed to do something on the other side that I didn't figure out this time around. Uh huh. Yeah. Short game. Short game is short. Nemo doesn't know what to do. Too challenging. Any ideas in chat? Let me know. Zilch. Nada, none at all. I would assume this is a door. There's a squeaky toy here that I can't. There are no, no actions I can do besides walking into places and then waiting for uh, something to pop up. How do you ruin something like that? <laughs> Whoops. I'm sorry, I clicked, uh, I clicked out of bounds here. I tried to activate the mouse to see if that works. Oh, burger and fries. Now you're making me jealous. Okay, so I have no idea what to do and the game isn't giving me any pointers. I can't go back. If it would be a puzzle, I could actually really start thinking about stuff. But it's currently just, uh, you know, it has these yellow rags here and I thought, oh, would you look at that? The yellow rags are from the division two. And as you know, from division two, if there's a yellow rag, you can. Okay, and the A to climb doesn't always pop up. Well, that's very dangerous, little one. Solved it. Okay, that's not what kids do. Just saying. I nearly stopped playing in the bloody introduction. There was no there was no interaction highlight and I didn't really think that the kid would pull out the cupboards to uh, anyway. Now we are the father figure. A 
we can clench our fists a bit. Now the door has a yellow handle. Yeah, I wanted to turn on the light. There's a cord to pull. Can't tell you where where to go though. It's totally cute that the dog is following me around, but Uh, are we going to chop the oranges because they've got the right color? Well, they sure did research on how dogs work. Paco knows where the food is. Let's follow the dog. Oh, now the light's on. Uh-huh. That was mean. Jesus Christ, that was. Ah, <laughs> oh, I was about to complain. It's a rather boring thing here with the food and and all that. What the actual hell? <laughs> oh, the game just saved itself, huh? Gamepad rumble is on. That needs to be off. The hell is this? Okay. Right, to the basement. Why are they not coming?
They are pointing at something. Oh, they packed the bag. Okay. Not basement then. What? Why are we leaving them? Oh, we're not. Okay. up the bag anymore now we go to the basement and I can't interact with the door either like a cup of tea Toddler dude, watch out. <laughs> that quote. Doggo is still here. bandage my arm hello here sir can't get up the doco is here A glowing arm now, so that's cool. By the window. Take care, T Bank. That's the second time I'm stuck in a small room with nothing to do because I have no bloody idea what the hell I'm supposed to do. Is that good? 
Is that what you want a game to do? I just got the wobbly arm and I can't do anything with it. I have no idea. There was music coming when I walked into this area for a bit. But that's it. Why? Okay, let's look for yellow things. Yeah, I tried. Maybe try again? There's yellow things. Aha! Uh -huh. Yeah, so... <laughs> oh, man. There was some yellow paint on it. It's It was barely invisible, right? It's kind of frustrating. So we... We use our arm to amplify light sources and then the blue stuff goes with or and then I'm guessing at what What next? That is so frustrating. I get if they don't want really a lot of pop-ups where you interact with things and that you need to sort of figure things out on your own, but if it's stuff like that where you can't really see anything and then you walk in circles for like five minutes, That just seems very avoidable.
I also am just not a fan of how controllers are sometimes being used in games. <laughs> it's just, I sit here and press the stick in random directions, like, yeah, okay, that's super cool. Yeah? Yeah, I'm gonna stop here. I don't enjoy this at all. I guess there's a cool a cool uh, story slash atmosphere to discover here, but I have not the patience to do that. Sorry. It's on Game Pass, so if you have that, you can check it out. <laughs> Figure out if it's if it's any good. I'm currently not there yet. I'm I'm not at you know. I'm going to play some Doom now. Um, yeah, no, I would, I would have to force myself through. Uh, um, I don't know. I just, I guess it's probably also hard for a game like this to come in as number six today. Uh, And the thing with slow paced games is that they are kind of kind of going against the grain for the discovery. I wanted to, you know, give me something, show me something. And it did, but <sighs> it's a walking simulator with interactive prompts that are yellow. And if you're lucky enough, you see them. And I'm, I, I just can't deal with that. Uh, Potentially, there's a pretty cool science fiction story here. Um, potentially. 